Patera Kalahari Custom. I'm making it my own, of course. I can't deal with the box stock stuff as far as the look. Uh, I just painted it today. Uh, I went with the blue theme. Not really a theme. Let me get it up over there. Let's see. Not done with it either. I still have more decal work to do on it. Still have more work to do. So that is actually a fresh paint job, and that is the ready uh, the, the the body that came with the ready to run. I painted it on the outside. Yeah, I've done it times before, and I've got a custom head on my driver figure. I have yet to paint. It's gonna look really good because you can see the face. Um, I did an inspection of the vehicle, and I really like it a lot. I have to say, it's well built. Um, I'm running a stock battery. But I switched out the pinion gear. I'm running a 10 tooth pinion to slow it down. Let me see. It's got the brushless system in it. So it's, I got it geared to go slow purpose. Thank you. Okay, let me see. A little bit of cogging in the brushless system. I don't mind. I still have yet to put a lipo in it. So that's it. Kalahari. Very well built. Very well built car. I do say so myself. The reason I slowed it down is because I'm into more scale RC driving. I'm not into the speed thing. I'd rather have slower speeds and a lot of torque and a lot of drive time and a motor that doesn't get too hot. So that's the reason I uh, slowed everything down. Again, there's a stock brushless system in it. Uh, still have more work to do yet. On the body, still more decal work. Quite a bit more decal work. The main only weakness that I found about the car, you know, I'm then again, I'm not a racer. I didn't get it to race, I got it to just, I don't even want to say bash, because I don't bash my stuff up, just to drive and have fun. Uh, only, only one weakness I found, uh, and that's the uh, the dust cover. I heard the DP makes a uh, really solid dust cover for it, but I tried to buy one, and they don't have them in stock, or they stopped making them one of the two. So, I have to... I'm gonna have to try to design my own dust cover just to make sure nothing gets in the in the spur gear. Because I'm in Florida and all in Florida all there is is sand. Nothing but sand. Yeah, like I said, I'm in the very scale driving. As you can see it, it handles really well. Really, really well. Extremely well actually. And uh, yeah, that's it. But the speed is fine for me. And then once I stick a lipo in there, it's gonna even be a little bit better. So right now, maybe maybe eight, nine miles an hour right now, that's fine. It's very scale speeds. Let's see what we can do here. Really liking this car. The more I drive it, this is my. By the way, this is my first time driving this car outside. First time. As soon as I got it, I stripped down the decals because, like I said, I can't stand look, driving a car and having it look, having it look just like uh, the box. I hate that. So yeah, I gotta have it look the way I want it to look. And I actually like it a lot more since I painted it. And I got it, like I said, this car, I have the twin hammers too. This car is actually out of the box. 
built better than the twin hammers. It doesn't have any serious weakness. Whereas the twin hammers doesn't have a many, just maybe one weakness with the twin hammer. That's the steering setup. The steering setup on the twin hammers is indeed very solid. I know I have the twin hammers. So I can complain. Other than that, it's a great car, but the steering setup on this is fine. It's fine. And, and, and true to what you heard, basically, this is a Mini 8. But I like this much better. It looks more like a real rally car, a rally truck. Rally. That's how I'm going to drive it anyway. I may even pick up another one. Who knows? We got a sale on them. Okay. Again, I'm a scale driver. I'm not into going 45 miles an hour. I'm into scale driving. That's it. Therefore, my speed is going to be much lower. I want to see if this motor heats up with a 10 tooth pinion. So I'm going to drive it hard for having a 10 tooth pinion in there. And actually for me, I'm more into scale RC, SCX-10, that kind of stuff. I actually uh, got this to be like a rally trail truck, mini. So, so far, so good. Yeah, let's see what we got here. Trail's real nice. I got the suspension set up as high as it'll go. Of course, mm, I love the radio. And this is, I'm in Florida, so we'll see if it really is a Kalahari <laughs> race truck. Because all in Florida is sand, baby, as you can see. Uh oh, I'm stuck. Okay, that's it. Let me get another nice pick again. I'm not done with the body. Here it is. Later.